Hi hey everyone, in today's video we are going to learn how to enter purchases and expenses in Xero. So for that purpose we will come in business option. So you will get option of bills to pay. Once we click here we will get this kind of interface. Okay. So from here you can create new bill, new credit note. Then you can also import in Excel format and you can also export the data in Excel. So I'll click on new bill. So once you click here you will get this kind of interface okay in from tab you can select the supplier and as of now we don't have any supplier so i just create new supplier from here so supplier 001 i'll click on new contact so and then after i enter the date of bill then after due date you can also enter due date day wise okay as you can see here then after references means number of bills you can also upload soft copy of bill here you can select the currency then after if you enter the bill as a tax inclusive or exclusive you can select the same from here in description i'll enter purchase in quantity i enter one unit price is 120 so from here i need to select the nominal code okay you can also add new account from here and currently i select 310 cost of goods sold that is purchase in same way you have to select tax rate from here you can also add new tax rate from here and by clicking here you can adjust the minor differences in values okay So as you can see net value VAT amount and gross amount and you can also add a new line from here okay now there are two options save and approve if you save this invoice then it will not affect our books of account and if you approve this bill then it will affect our books of account okay so I'll click on approve and add another So once you click here you will get the same display so if you want to add continue invoices then you can click on approve and add another okay now if you want to see the bills then you can go in purchase overview option and I'll click on see all Okay, so you can see the bill if you want to make any changes then you have to click on the bill so you can print to PDF here okay then after in bills option you can see repeat if you want to repeat the bill you can delete you can cancel by clicking on void you can copy the bill you can add credit note and you can edit from here also so after editing you can you have to update the bill okay and from bills to pay option you can also see the list of bills which has been created by us so in this manner you can create bills the purchase bills and expenses in zero this is for today thanks for watching kindly like the video and subscribe the channel thank you